There's a scroll. Doubt I'd understand it anyway. These are a stonemason's tools. Good morning, Liol. Good morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. Hey, um... Yes? It's time to make our way to the village. Okay. Let's get moving. Hey, Xinhua. What is it, Liu? It's time to make our way to the village. Got it. Let's get moving. Let's go. Yeah. Your house is pretty far from the village, huh, Shenhua? Oh, yes, I suppose you're right. Is there a reason for that? The quarry could be one. Sorry? The quarry. It's a special one that even I'm not allowed to enter. Ah. So, your house is there to protect it? Yes, I believe so. Father didn't tell me anything about it, though. I see. Do you know what the dragon and phoenix in the quarry were for? No, I don't. But your father carved them, right? Yes, he must have. He wasn't alone, though. What do you mean by that? They must have taken generations to complete. So, you think your grandfather worked on them, too? Yes, possibly even further back than that. Have you heard any stories about them? Not a single one. My father always said he'd tell me when I got older. Then how do you know it has so much history? Well, everyone in the village has history. The villagers? Yes. Generations of stonemasons, hunters, and farmers have all lived here. The same goes for the cattle wranglers. They've been here for ages. Oh, yeah? That's just how things work here.
Is this a dojo? That's right. This is Marshall Hall. It's been here for ages. Marshall Hall? Long ago, many great martial artists traveled here from all over the world. But no one comes here nowadays. Is that so? Ryo, you should come here to practice when you have time. Is that okay? Of course. Our doors are open to everyone that comes here looking to master the martial arts. Are you a new trainee? Sorry? Hmm, you're Japanese. I am. The people of Bailu Village have trained here for centuries. It has history. Did you say centuries? You would do well to train here if you have lost sight of the path. You can polish your techniques. So you'll let me train here? Not only that, I'll let you prove yourself by fighting the monks here. You're on. A fight? Very well. Your first opponent shall be Red Tiger. He is our least skilled monk, but do not underestimate him. say you will you join us yes absolutely very well what is your name Ryo Hazuki I shall have a name tag prepared for you you will start from the lowest rank rank yes you must fight and defeat someone above your rank in order to move up you must train day in and day out to improve your kung fu Whose shop is that? Over the bridge. Oh, it belongs to Uncle Tao. Uncle Tao, huh? Yes, people can get anything they need from his shop. I see. Leo, did you pack anything to eat? Why do you ask? Well, you can't run on an empty stomach. That's a very good point. Be sure to keep a little something on hand in case you get hungry later. A lot of places in the village sell food, too. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind.
Leo, this herb. This is... It's licorice. You can make Chinese medicine with it. So, you can turn this into medicine, huh? Not just this. There are lots of herbs growing in Bailu. Where do they grow? They're all over the place, but you have to really look for them. Oh, really? There should be special maps at Uncle Tao's shop. Someone actually made maps? Yes, if you find enough to make some medicine, Uncle Tao will buy them from you. Okay, I'll have to keep that in mind. I would like to know, what's the tall tower just past the village square? Uh, yes, that's the bell tower. What is it for? We ring the bell if there's a fire in the mountains, or if something dangerous is encroaching on the village. Is that why it's so tall? Precisely. It's also a useful landmark, because you can see it from anywhere in the village. That's handy. So, you can find your way back to the square, if you head for the bell tower? That's right. I'll have to keep that in mind. Excuse me. Oh, hey kid. What do you want? Have you come to apprentice under me? Oh, uh, nothing. You're a beginner, right? You have a name? Ryo Hazuki. Well, Ryo, it's your lucky day. Fear not, for I am the great Suza Xiong. I can forge a formidable master out of the most hopeless of pupils. You stand before a Chun Tai cheer master. Um, yeah, I'm good. Thanks. What? You don't think I've got what it takes? Th that's not what I. Then let me show you what I've got. Fight me, right now! Oh, man. Look, I'm not opposed, but. It's too late now, R It was Ryo, right? Yeah. 
Thanks for that. Well, how's it feel? Pretty nice to train with a master like me, isn't it? Hmm? Uh, sure. Come by any time. I'm always up for a fight. Hi there. Zhe Xiang. What gives, young lady? Have we met or something? It's me, Shen Hua. Shen Hua? Look at you! You've grown like a weed since we last met. Have you seen the thugs that came here recently? Thugs, huh? I'll help you get rid of them. They don't call me the Lu Bu of Bai Lu Village for nothing. Zhe Xiang. Did you say Lu Bu? Wasn't he a bit of a thug himself? Wait, what? You sure? Well, you might have noticed, but this ain't no freaking school! Right. Hi, Zhishong. Good timing, bud. I was just starting to get bored. Let's spar. Okay. You're on. I knew you'd say yes. Take this! Here I go! Thanks for that. Well, how's it feel? Pretty nice to train with a master like me, isn't it? Hmm? Uh, sure. 
Come by any time. I'm always up for a fight. Hey, I have nothing to say to a stranger. Um... You're not from around here, are you? Excuse me. Looks like it's a young man this time. Um... There's always something interesting coming in from the Lijiang River. Huh? Uh, first a tree, then a goat. I wonder what's going to show up next. Hey. <laughs> Mr. Jiang, there's something we'd like to ask you. If it isn't Shenhua. Have you seen the thugs that came to the village recently? Thugs, eh? Well, now that you mention it, I did see a group of shifty-looking strangers. They barged in at night and gave me their evil eye. What did they want? Who knows? They quickly left without saying anything. I see. Thank you, Mr. Jiang. Hey, have you seen the thugs that came to Bai Lu? Mm, thugs, eh? Well, now that you miss. Right. I need help with something. I have nothing to say to a stranger. Can I talk to you about something? Sh Shenhua, w what's up? This is Liu. He's a friend of mine. For real? Did you see any thugs come here? No, but I heard some other people talking about it. Seems like some people got their homes trashed. Okay, thanks. Actually, I'm more worried about Yuan than those thugs. Thanks, Mingyong. Oh, uh, don't mention it. I'm just, you know. Hey. Who are you, young man? I can't help but notice you've been wandering around here lately. My name is Ryo Hazuki. Ah, so you're Japanese. Sorry, dear. 
I'm going to have to ask you to leave. I'm not too partial to strangers. Wait, Mrs. Zhang. Oh, Shenhua. I didn't know you were here. This is Liu. He's my friend. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? Now, what can I do for you? I've got a question. Have you seen the thugs that came to the village recently? Oh, yes. Those hooligans came here, too. What did they want? They seemed to be looking for something. They were turning the house inside out. In a mountain village like this, the only thing that has any value are the stones that Yuan carves. Could the thugs have taken my father? That's not the only possibility. Oh, really? Do you know where they went after that? No, dear. Your guess is as good as mine. They vanished without a trace. I see. Maybe I'll talk to a few folks around here. I should talk to more people around here. Excuse me. You're not from around here, are you? You're Ai Fang. This is a friend of mine. Um... Is that right? Have you seen the thugs that came to the village recently? Word has it they showed up at the Wong household. But Wen's lips are sealed. Maybe she'd open up to you. It's worth a shot. Thank you very much. Just be careful, okay? She'd be heartbroken if anything were to happen to you. Huh? Who would be heartbroken? Shenhua, that's who! Actually, I... Oh dear. There I go running my mouth again! <laughs> okay then. I've got a question. Have you seen Wong Wen? There's something I'd like to ask her. Oh, I'm sure she's around here somewhere talking up a storm to someone. I see. Let's go, Ryo. Is anyone there? Uh, looks like no one's home. Excuse me. Oh, hello. How about a game of lucky hit? Um... Come on, come on, try it! Not right now. Oh, so you don't like lucky hit?
Excuse me. Hey there, lad. How about a game? Do you have a moment? It costs ten yuan to play. You open your wallet, or I shut my mouth. I should talk to more people around here. Hi there. Is Wong Wen around? There's something I'd like to ask Wang Wen. She's not around? I was just talking to her. I see. She said something about going shopping, so maybe she already left for Taoget. Got it. Thanks. Maybe I'll talk to a few folks around here. <laughs> 